Hello Pisces, welcome to your warrior drum reading for April the 1st through the 10th. Your stone people card is Otter Medicine, Feminine Energy and Playfulness. That's great. Spirit Animal, oh, is the Hummingbird. All about love and joy. Sign and Symbol is the Harmony card. Nice, those are three very positive cards to start with. Okay, now we're going to uh, do our drum reading. This is a real drum, and we'll play it a little bit when we're all done. Okay, the drum is not just a musical instrument. It is a connection between you and Mother Earth, and it is known as the heartbeat of Mother Earth. It is, drums are always a circle because they represent the circle of life. It holds the spirit of whatever animal hide it was made of. This drum was made from elk hide. And so we have our little elk tooth here as well. Okay, and then we'll play it a little bit as well as uh, have a the elk prayer at the end here. Now the elk, also known as wapiti, represent stamina, determination, bravery, patience. They were known as a protector and a teacher and considered a relative, a sister or brother, not quote, an animal. So very different way of looking at things. Okay, so in the east, we have a Laramar. Deep calm, peace, quiet confidence, and clear communication. As with the medicine wheel, the east is the place of what is coming into your life. And we have coral and nurturing. The shaman, trust in higher forces. And pig spirit, use your mind wisely in a positive way. Okay, in the south is the place of innocence and the inner child. We have Coco Pelli, fertility. The seeds that you plant now will come to fruition. We have the medicine guardian. Be open to new healing information. And otter spirit. Oh, you are never alone. Represented here in the south by abalone. Calming and soothing, healing, protective, and peaceful. You got two very peaceful stones to start. Okay, in the West, we have calcite, which is all about empathy and tuning into your emotions, helps you express your needs, get back in the flow, and dissolve old beliefs. The West is the place of lessons learned. We have thunder beings. You're being given usable energy. The shield maiden says, make plans and focus. And you're being given the energy to do that. And bee spirit says, if you do that, sweet results await. Awesome. Okay, in the north is the place of wisdom and gratitude. And we have apophyllite the heavenly cloud. It calms the overactive mind and body, enhances intuition, connects with the angels, and reduces fears, worries, and anxieties. You have all, all of these are very calming. We have the storyteller and expansion. That means that you have the ability to expand your story. 
Oh, you have the guardian angel. You are not alone. You have two cards here telling you that you are not alone. And then we end up with Sam Piper Spirit. Be playful. That's awesome. Let's see what your rune is. Oh, you have the rune of success. Awesome. And Sister Moon says, oh, look at that. A win-win outcome is forecast. And your success rune. So that's very, very positive. This was a very positive, peaceful reading. Okay, so I'm just going to take these off here. So you can hear what the drum sounds like. And we'll do the elk prayer. Now that is why this is considered a warrior drum, because it is made from elk hide. Okay? So you can see the wood. This is all leather ties the drum the drum is also a circle of life a medicine wheel and you can see that it is represented here with white at the north red in the east south and west each one has a color and significance okay and this is what it sounds like So the louder, of course, but it has its own tone, and each drum has its own tone, depending on what it, the size of it and what it's made of. So the elk prayer in Sioux is like this. Elk, your strength and stamina far exceed those of your predators. Your unpredictability is an asset. May I take pride in myself and all my doings with the nobility of elk. I have the strength to go the distance and the sensitivity to respond to my surroundings with love and compassion. So there it is. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Peace, love, and light. Until next time.